now friends this is logics next the enterprise solution for logistics and transportation from bng infotech on the screen you see various modules that covers the entire business processes of various type of transporters which is full truck load part load parcel services truck owners fleet management freight forwarding warehousing hr payroll and uh various forward and backward integration with your vendors and customers so today we will conduct a very small presentation what it all covers in various modules starting with operations operations cover the entire business process of a transporter that is from consignment booking to delivery billing to payment receipts and lorry hire payments the module opens with notifications and alerts the notification that you see on the screen is arrival inward what is coming from which station which branch of yours the second alert is the dispatch that is you have already booked the consignment and what should be loaded same way you have the pending pod proof of delivery how many proof of delivery are pending which are not yet entered into the system similarly you will have another one that is the placement pending for each of the consignment and order you have roughly it covers contract management documents management order management booking and loading delivery and related reports so in this module before going in detail in this module we will see how the reports are generated let's have a look at the dashboard logics provides a very fine reporting system for the top management that comes under this mis report and you can see graphical as well as data this report shows you both graphics as well as data if you click at the data part you see the figures on the screen so you have many reports available over here you can just have a look monthly revenue versus expenditure the report for each month what is loaded and what has been the total business carried out by you monthly load versus freight report quarterly revenue growth quarterly growth top customer by revenue top customer by load top expensive vehicle least expensive vehicle stock summary etc etc and we have added few more reports for the top management that is for your financial positions uh, for pnl for each branch consignment wise expenses pending trips etc etc so in this module you come to know about various reports and in how these reports are generated i'm going to show you in a very fast and uh, perfect manner under contract you have the customer contract management uh, you can make contract for uh, the one customer or for a region or for the entire country for entire uh, state and what it all covers is for example freight rate you are going to make for a particular customer so you just need to pick your customer and use a template so any of this template we'll explain in another video where we train how, how what is choose and how we make it but this is for the demonstration purpose only so this is how you are going to make a contract for this particular customer giving various inputs from date range and for a particular type of consignment or particular particular type of shipment whether this is by road by rail or by year and what would be the prices so in each of these you come to know these are the various type of contract you have created this is a contract you have created for a company with customer destination and weight and that is from uh, which destination to which station 
Now we go to the next part, transporters. That is for each transporters, you can create a rate contract that is from which station to which station, what type of lorry, what size of lorry is available, uh, would be available uh, to you. Under manage document, you have pre-printed documents like uh, LR books, consignment books, bill books, etc. How many printed? And for an automatic environment, computerized environment, you can issue serial numbers for each of your branches from where you are going to make it. Now we come to the order management. This is the order where you punch in the total order received from one company that is in bulk and uh, from one of your customer. And now on this, uh, you make LR for against each order that we'll be explaining how you do. We have booking operation, creation of consignment. We have two options here. One is consignment API, another is consignment API is for uh, automatic pulling of data from GST server. Consignment, creation of a consignment. These are the usual fields available here. Consignment, route, credit terms, payment terms, and then whether this mode by year, cargo express or multimodal. And based on these parameters, the rate, the prices change accordingly. Uh, consigner, consignee, billing party, whether the delivery is uh, door delivery or the go down delivery and uh, the load type, what type of drugs in case of full drug load. And for part load, you can select part load and then uh, the prices will be passed accordingly. The contents, quantity, weight and invoice and this detail would be there. And then you have the total charges and uh, these charges consist of uh, the other loading unloading and other charges that you configure in the system uh, the other detail in the consignment that is the order number detail and other uh, risk related insurance related and uh, load etc and if it's a container movement so container related detail and then is the invoice detail invoice attachment of the party and if the cod is their cash against delivery so collection uh, so you have to mention this so how you can look at the data you just click on this this and select one data which is available to you here and now you can see the details and uh, this is uh, you have created and now you can if you want to see a uh, consignment format so consignment format is available in a print format like given here so you can also uh, it can be changed it can be customized by the company for uh, to make it suitable for your uh, business now the second part we move to the quickly move to the next one is manifest or also known as loading chalan whereby you have uh, you create this loading chalan giving the source and destination and get the data and it will pick all the consignment booked for this particular des destination and you have to just select it from the list you have to just select it from the list and say for example new delhi to so new delhi to kolkata and now we say you are, you get this data from this destination to this destination Kolkata from this date to this date you can pick the date and show the consignment it will show it shows all the consignment that have been booked and here you have to just select it and get it back so it is entered into the system so you already have this consignment over here and the other detail about the vehicles and drivers etc needs to be entered and your loading chalan or your loading uh, sheet or manifest is ready now third part in the business process is hire of a truck so when you hire a truck from the market you make a lorry hire contract so this is a lorry hire contract you are creating it's also called lorry hire memo which is uh, created uh, for that particular source to destination and uh, 
so which is the manifest that is being carried on that truck so you enter the manifest number and the transporter when you enter the transporter detail here the transport the truck list would come over here and also it will show you the different heads that is the debit and credit which is uh, of course linked with the financial accounting so what is to be paid and in this uh, manifest you define how much is total how much total is to be paid to the lorry owner and uh, the advance amount paid in cash and uh, the card amount is paid by the credit card and if paid by the fuel uh, card or fuel slip how much and how much total is to be paid so uh, this is ba balance account posting is done from here balance account and uh, some other heads so it is totally uh, linked with financial accounting so we can see one data over here that will help you understand the application better we just pick one data and this is this you can see how uh, the total is to be paid payable at this particular branch to, to this particular transporter assam roadways is span number every date comes so this is the uh, loading part now we quickly go to the delivery operation unloading and pod we have unloading when the truck reaches the destination you make your unloading whereby you have to simply mention only the mf number that is the manifest number that comes from the other branch so it uh, populates the complete data in this and you have to enter what is short and access what was uh, loaded and what is received if there is any disc discrepancy uh, so it has to be mentioned here that will be helpful in further uh, tracking of the consignment and further uh labeling of the charges whether it has to be if there is any shortage whether this has to be detected from the transporter or it has to be uh, billed to the transporter or it has to be or your customer will detect that amount so unloading so you have uh, a deduction section where uh, what is the deduction to be made from the transporter or the driver and what is to be added or deducted from the customer both way you have incentive penalty every head is there and when you make a payment this is automatically shown on your payment advice so <clears throat> unloading is very important part as far as accounting is concerned next we will take pot proof of delivery receiving of the delivery so separately you can have a, a soft copy a, a image which is usually signed and uploaded here against a particular consignment so this process again in this process also we have additional charges uh, given usually the pod is used by full truck load transporter and while the unloading is used by part load which is in multiple consignment in one go but in uh, pod uh, has almost the similar uh, financial linkages that is uh, payable and receivable and other any other charges which are not mentioned in the lr so this is pod so you can have a look at the pod i just receive a pod from for this particular consignment 1017 on this particular date so every each in, information is there and also you have a upload if the copy is there it can be uploaded and shown later on as a soft copy always saved in your server so this is the other part pod and based on this we have n number of reports we have inquiry uh, for each consignment history multiple vehicle hire bill branches then you have multiple report registers analytical reports mia reports pending report that is your jobs received but not executed vehicle hire pending arrival pending pod billing pending you have already created a consignment and pod but not billed so that is billing bill submission indent and this and there are many more tools available consignment import and printing and inter office memo and this presentation will end here 
and we'll come up with another presentation for rest of the module. Thank you very much. Be with us. Thank you very much.